And good morning. We are at the testing center for yet another radiology exam for me to take. You may remember from my last video about a year ago, I filmed it right here, right at that testing site. If you don't remember, you can click up here. I did a whole kind of video talking about all the exams we have to take in residency and med school and all that stuff, all the exams that doctors have to take. However, this is the last time I have to take this exam, the radiology certifying exam. I'm not really sure why we have to take it because I already passed boards like eight months ago and this is just more of a formality per se. But nonetheless, I have to take another exam and I'm going to try to take it as fast as possible because we are going to the airport right after this. So, babe, wish me luck. Good luck, Dr. Cellini. <laughs> so she just dropped me off. I'm gonna run inside, take the exam, and we are going to the airport right afterwards. So the test is over, and now, we are going to get some breakfast before we catch our flight. So the test is over, it went pretty well. I mean, it doesn't really matter, but it's amazing how much you remember of all that stuff, even though it's been like a year since I've even studied all of it. Anyways, it went well, even though it doesn't matter. And now we're gonna get some breakfast. officially at the airport now. Um, I ended up taking the exam in like 30 minutes, which I think you're allotted like an hour and 45 minutes to take it, but I didn't really need that long because I've taken these tests for like four years now and it's pretty easy at this point, even though I didn't study at all, because it doesn't matter. And I already passed boards. So anyways, I haven't officially told you why we are going to the airport today. We are flying to Cleveland, Ohio. And I haven't been to Cleveland, Ohio since like 1999 when my grandpa died so it's been quite a bit of time but my dad is born and raised there and he currently lives there he actually just moved back recently so we're gonna go take a visit and see what Cleveland Ohio is like and yeah I'm looking forward to it the only thing that I'm worried about is it is snowing all weekend which I'm actually pretty excited for because we haven't experienced snow down here yet it's been a pretty warm winter but the only issue is we may not be able to fly out or fly home so We'll see how it goes, and I'll take you along for the journey. As you can see, we are back at the hotel. And by back at the hotel, I mean we are at the hotel in Cleveland. We are just getting ready for dinner, AKA I'm ready and Adriana's getting ready for dinner with my uh, dad. And that's pretty much it. I don't know where we're going. Apparently it's supposed to be really good. A local favorite, if you will. And that's all I got. So we're gonna go to dinner and see how it goes. And we officially made it back at home. We had that crazy good dinner, ate a whole bunch of Italian food, and now we're hitting the hay. So I'll see you guys in the morning. Hey. And good morning. It is Saturday, and 
We woke up this morning, went straight to the Starbucks across the street. I don't know what's about this. You want to go with the windy dog? No, I can't fit in there. Let's go. Just went to Starbucks. We are going to grab breakfast somewhere around Cleveland with the pops and see where that goes. And then we are going to make his famous meatballs later, which I'm super excited for. And I plan to film all that. Where's Pops? Breakfast time with Pops. Say hello, Pops. <laughs> Step one, already made meatballs that we will be making <laughs> soon. <laughs> so we roll the meatballs, we go directly into the pan. But wait, so you brown these for how long? Till they're, they're brown? <laughs> Would you say you brown them till they're brown? Mm -hmm. And while these cook, we'll enjoy some pizza. With some wine. <laughs> Yeah. With some wine. Yeah, but I'm in the basement, so I can't bring enough to burn. No, I'd rather just push my phone and watch a movie and pick up. You know, I'm like, well, I'm like, oh, oh, no, I don't know. I never saw her. Going well. Adding and onions. And I think I knew my mom. Deglaze the pan. Oh yeah, we deglaze the pan. Now we and add we'll what? More tomatoes. Some crushed tomatoes. Mm -hmm. Crushed tomato. So it's about ninety percent. How much are these dressed? Eighty percent. Cook them the rest of the way in the sauce. Uh, And good morning, it is now Sunday morning. I am walking outside and it's snowing a little bit, which is pretty sweet. Um, last night we had a fantastic time just drinking wine. Sorry, the music was so loud in there. Anyways, got my Starbucks coffee. We are getting ready because we are going to the airport uh, right now. And then we are going to grab, oh wait, what am I talking about? I haven't had coffee yet. We are uh, getting dressed and going to brunch with my pops one last time before we head to the airport later today. So, had a fantastic time so far. Let's finish it out strong with a nice brunch together. See you soon. Oh wait, we can go over there. Oh, oh breakfast time. Say hey, pops. Say, say, say hey to the, so, say hey to the vlog. Hi, vlog. <laughs> and we are back at the airport, Cleveland airport, ready to head back home now. We have a layover. So two flights today, hopefully they get out on time. Hopefully there's no snow. And yeah, that is what the next five hours are devoted to, traveling again. So I think it's pretty safe to say we had a fantastic time in Cleveland, Ohio, or we spent most of our time in Wallaby, Ohio, which is like a small suburb of Cleveland. But either way, we had a good time. We toured pretty much everywhere. Went down a little Italy, ate a whole bunch. I honestly ate so much this weekend. We ate whole spaghetti meatballs, a cake, pastries yesterday and this morning I said I wasn't gonna eat anything because I ate so much last night and we had a huge brunch and we'll be working out every hour this week <laughs> I can't stand her so I'll be working out pretty much every day this week and 
that's pretty much it. Look at her. I can't even. We ate so much. All we did was eat. And I feel like uh, I weigh a thousand pounds. So we're gonna work out every day this week and eat pretty much lettuce only for a week to recover. And we go. Yeah. And we go back to work tomorrow, which is unfortunate. Even though I'm on the ICU, and I haven't told you guys about the ICU yet because I've been on the ICU for two weeks now and have two weeks left. So I'll probably do a whole video on why I'm doing the ICU rotation and all that stuff. So stay tuned for that video. <laughs> so we have a we have two flights to catch now. So we have two flights to catch now and let's see how it goes. And we are officially back at home, which means this video has come to an end. So as always, make sure you smash that like and subscribe button and follow me on Instagram if you don't already. Leave a comment below if I like it. I'll respond to it. I don't know what to say. Otherwise, we'll see you on the next video. And smash and like and subscribe button. <laughs> Otherwise, we'll see you in the next video. You didn't even hit the thing. Oh, you had to say. Otherwise, we'll see you on the next video. Hit this. Oh.